Hey guys, so this is how I make comics on my iPad on Procreate. So in this first one, I'm showing you a speed paint of a comic that I made that is in black and white. So basically, I'm going to be doing both um, how I make comics in black and white and how I make them with color. So here's the first example. It's basically the comic that I've been kind of working on on the side right now. And basically what I do when I'm making black and white comics is I just make the boxes first and then I sketch out the things that I want in each box and then I um, make another layer on top of the sketch and I turn the sketch layer down and then I just ink it and then after I finish inking it I usually just delete the um, sketch layer or I just click end to make it not show and then I just add in the details like the lines and cool pen art in the background and that's basically how I do the um, black and white comics. Okay so this is the next one, this is how I make a comics that are in color so basically what I do is um, sometimes I sketch it out in my sketchbook and I just insert it into procreate and then outline it with the ink but that's what I used to do um, so then I just ink it on procreate and then I delete the sketch layer again and then I usually don't add in the details I just start coloring it with the basic colors in a layer underneath the ink layer and then I add in all those shadows and lighting and everything like that after I finish coloring it. And my tip for doing shadows and lighting is to like look at another example or like reference to see how the light would look and that definitely helps to make it just look normal and look good and look professional. So yeah, that's how I make the color comics.
Okay, so now, um, when I'm making the cover of the comics, so this is like the current comic cover that I've been working on, and basically what I do is I just draw it and make it really detailed and stuff, and kind of like how I would do a colored comic, and then I insert it onto a page that would look like the cover, you know? And then I, um, I add in the name of the cover, so basically I design the, like, name first on a different, um, canvas, and then I insert it onto the cover, and I just erase the edges to make it look neat, and then I add all those words for, like, oh, my name and stuff, and that's basically how I make the covers.